hurt us. Also, he will repay us for the good things that we have done and the good things we are thinking about doing. He will repay us in what it says here in Galatians chapter 6, verse 9, let us not grow weary while doing good. When we're doing good to glorify the and honor Heavenly Father, in due season, it says here, we shall reap if we do not lose heart. That's the part of, of being repaid for us doing good to glorify, honor, and praise Heavenly Father. And he will, will reward us in his time and his way and his will as we are following and doing his word. And then the repentance will come as we are turning away from our sins. We're turning away from that old attitude and we're getting a new attitude. And so I want to end with a little encouraging song I wrote, <laughs> you know, April of 2022, many months ago, I wrote a song and I wanted to share it with you. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> and it's called Release. It's just titled Release. You know, sometimes we need to release the pain and the hurt that we have experienced from a family member, from a friend. We need to release the hurt and the pain from the individual who may have caused us to feel. Sometimes people hurt us and they don't know they hurt us. Maybe they did it unknowing, unknowingly hurting us. They just didn't know and we didn't express our feelings of hurt and pain. They thought everything was okay. And that's why it's important to communicate in a loving, compassionate fashion toward individuals because people are going through a lot of troubles and sometimes we just don't know what a person is going through. So this song I wrote in April 2022, <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm going to I'm going to start out singing it and then uh, just ask Heavenly Father and Holy Spirit to give me the voice to sing. I've been going through a lot, as you know, with my dental health and wellness journey and taking care of my husband who was in another bicycle accident. So Heavenly Father is there with us, even though we go through some troubles and trials and tests and tribulations, but I'm going to keep trusting in Yahweh Him. He's going to bring me through and bring me out with the, your prayers. Thank you for your prayers. And with the Heavenly Father's Holy Spirit, and with the Heavenly Father's hand and power, peace, protection, provision, his anointing, his favor, his endurance. So here's the song. I will release the hurt and pain. Yahweh will help me to gain His love and mercy today. I will release the hurt and pain. Yahweh will help me to gain His love and mercy today. I will release my hurt and pain. Yahweh will help me to gain His love and mercy today. I will release my hurt and pain. I will release the guilt and shame. Yahweh will help me to gain His love and mercy, His healing, His deliverance, His forgiveness, His strength, His wisdom today. I will release all hurt and pain. Yahweh will help me to gain His love and grace and mercy today. 
I hope that song and our biblical fellowship and spiritual time together will help bring all of us emotional, mental, physical, spiritual, and financial wholeness and wellness. Thank you for your time. And let's end with prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, Almighty Yahweh, thank you for this wonderful time we spent together with our family and friends. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for this special time with your presence and your hand and your power and your Holy Spirit and your holy angels and your holy, holy holiness is around us and surrounding us and guiding, directing, leading us. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for all your many blessings, past, present, and future. Thank you for waking us up, being us during the day. Continue to have your hand upon us to guide and direct our steps, thoughts, and actions today and every day. Thank you, Heavenly Father. We humbly come down to you, bowing down to your throne, uh, either on the ground or the knees of our heart, down at your throne, Heavenly Father, with a humble fashion. We humble ourselves under your mighty hand. In due time, you will raise us up and you will protect us from all demonic, evil, wicked people, places, things, situations, events by your hand, Heavenly Father, by your Holy Spirit, and by your Holy Son, the Messiah. Thank you for your holy angels, cherubim, seraphim, archangels. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for all your many wonderful, supernatural miracle signs and wonders that you're doing in our life now and beyond. Prepare us to live holy, pure, and righteous in these days of Noah, days of Lot. In the last days, but now living in the name of Messiah, Yeshua, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we give all glory, honor, praise to you as we lift our hands up to you, Heavenly Father, in Yeshua, Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. Thank you so much for your wonderful time. Please go to our website for more free Holy Bible scripture readings, teachings, and messages on butterflyjourney.org. Thank you. May the Heavenly Father bless you.